Shoot them on the left. Hey! <laughs> What up guys and welcome back to another one and today it's a special one, let me tell you. Today we're going to be headed out west and we're going to be hunting with Gerald. A lot of you remember Gerald from all the pigeon hunting that we did this summer. We did a lot of pigeon hunting this summer together and you guys enjoyed it. You guys enjoy Gerald, he is such a funny dude and an awesome hunter. Well today we're going to be trafficking specs in white. So yeah, today's going to be the first day. Uh, laying in a uh, white spread in white hoodies and white painter suits and the whole nine yards But before we get going here. I got to show you this saucy shirt. Look at this bad boy duck hunt or die Yeah, pretty sweet. It's got a military feel to it to me It does but I think it's freaking awesome. It's a 48 hour t-shirt So this bad boy is only gonna be available for 48 hours and then she gonna be gone So 48 hours from right now when you're watching this video this shirt's gonna go live and in two days, she ain't going to be available no longer. So if you guys want to pick up this shirt, you know what to do. Go down in the description and click the link for the new 48-hour Ducks t-shirt and pick it up before she gone. But like I said, uh, they just have a ton, a ton, absolute load of the specs out west. I mean, crazy. Uh, Gerald didn't get a feed in particular, but he did get an awesome field right under their primary flyway that we're gonna set a monster spread. I'm sure we're gonna have over, I don't know, probably over 1,200 decoys out with solos and socks total. So it's about to be a monster spread. Get my white hoodie. Let's roll, fellas. Let's get on out of here. Let's go whack us some specs, shall we? Why, why, why does it always have to start raining on the way to the field? Been dealing with rain a lot lately. We went to uh, Canada and it seemed like every morning on the way to the field it was sprinkling or downpouring, one of the two. Supposed to be having a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of cold front material moving right in. It's uh, 42 degrees out right now. We're sitting at 4.53 in the morning. Been having a great wind all morning. We're gonna see how it switches up. I haven't got to look at the radar and see what it's supposed to do, but I think it's supposed to be up there, well above 10 mile an hour in two days. So, so the sock should be flapping back and forth pretty well. Well, we are in the field, and it uh, looks like we have about 10 guys, and we are sitting a massive spread. I'm gonna uh, use the GoPro 5 and do a little time lapse for y'all. Us sitting the spread. So, enjoy the time lapse. There we go, boys. Nice. Oh, well, I forgot the camera. I thought I forgot the big camera in Gerald's truck, so I had to literally just walk a half a mile to go grab it. But we are laying in all white, as you can tell. First big white hunt of the year. And uh, hope you guys enjoyed them time lapses. Uh, I'm, I'm done on specs. I can't shoot anymore, as you guys seen on the head mount. But uh, going good so far. This is a full on traffic hunt. This is not a feed that Gerald's found. This is just a flyaway and uh, we're having to suck them down from really really high. So uh, we sat out over 70 dozen dive bomb silos and we've sat out probably I would say another 70 dozen uh, white socks. So it is uh, going good so far. It's huge. I will show you the spread here in just a minute when I get there.
side, shoot those birds. Nice. Nice. Nice, 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 boys. The single's just eating it up. He has been locked up from the heavens. Look at him. We got a lot more coming. The single just wants to give it up. Look at him. Oh, is it? He barred up. Someone on the left shoot that bird. Oh, <laughs> boy. Well, we had more coming, but Gerald said that's a barred up bird. That's a that's an adult there. That's a good looker. A lot of, lot of juvies out here. A lot of young birds. So, um, picking out the pretty ones for sure. If we're going to be able to shoot them. Might as well pick out the pretty ones, right? Look at them just coming down, right down the pipe. Right down the pipe. These birds are loving it. Shoot them. Nice. Oh, nice. That was a far that's shot. Got two down. Good shooting, boys. <laughs> they were they, they they picked up when they hit the spread a little bit there. <laughs> well, the lessers like the spread too, so it lets us know we're doing something good here. Boy, how do these singles and pairs do it on the deck? Shoot him on the left. Another one. Nice. Nice, boys. The singles and pairs are just doing it all sorts of dirty. This is nice. I mean, this is a huge, huge spread. We have everything from uh, Canada Sillows, Spec Sillows, Canada Socks, Snow Goose Socks. <laughs> headed snow goose socks we have out the entire kitchen sink today so uh, we're drawing a lot of attention it's actually working so fun hunt really good so far Shoot him. <laughs> oh, that boy, all kinds of dead. You know what that was? That was a Dusty McAllen boy. That was a Dusty McAllen. <laughs> oh, old Dusty McAllen. Gotta love him. He was high. Oh, he was
shoot boy. Oh, three of them bad boys. Woo! All three of them. Good shooting boys. That was nice. My goodness. Yeah, that high left was, was a beauty. I seen that. He had a dark old belly. So if you guys don't know, the darker the belly, the darker the bar is on a spec, the older it is. So you want to be looking for some trophy birds, look for the dark bellies. I know a bunch of you know that, but there's a lot of beginners on here that don't. Hunting with Gerald today. Like I said, if you guys want to book a hunt with Central Kansas Outfitters, follow them on Instagram right here. Shoot them a DM. See what dates they have available. Well, they've been booking dates left and right. You want to lay in white, traffic snows, traffic specs, candidates, everything. They do big spreads like this. Right? Yep. Yeah. Well, pick one. Pick one and shoot it. Right Don't miss. Yeah. Good miss. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor Jake. Hey, we got one poor guy. One. Jake's with the last bird. Don't miss. Uh, oh, oh, nice. Oh. 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 <laughs> we are done. I want to double That's check a to make spec sure limit right sure. there. That was nice. That went pretty quick. Huh? Not bad! Well, Not bad at all! Oh. I didn't mention it very much, but we are using the new gun today. Out. Check out that beauty. Woo. I liked it, I liked it. I got a couple extended chokes coming for it, an improved mod and a full, but it shot good. It kicks a little harder, but... It kicks a little harder. I, I, it feels like maybe it's just because I'm shooting BBs today, but um, it did well. I can't wait to get the chokes for it, and uh, I'll, I'll have a lot more confidence with it for sure, but the gun is working. So, spread wise, like I said, we got a bunch of silos, a bunch of socks out, no full bodies. Uh, it's roughly 110 dozen total, uh, 75 dozen silos, and roughly 30 to 40 dozen socks. So, that's what it's looking like today. It went up really fast. So, it is just now 8 o'clock. Yeah, it's now 8 o'clock. We've been limited out for 20 minutes, so we literally did a nine man limit of specs, which it's to a man. We did it in probably 30, 45 minutes at the most. 8.04. Yeah. That went fast. Well, we're going to pick this bad boy up. Oh, oh look at him. Oh. <laughs> look at that. That's a good in there, boys. Oh. oh, you got my gun for me? Well, thanks, son. Thank you. Look at that pretty girl right there. I will have to say that I liked the new gun. It was pretty nice. I'm, I can't wait to get... Uh, a uh, improved mod and full choke for it um, that's one thing that I really do want and they're coming on the way so but I really like the gun it was uh, it's really light I mean probably the lightest gun I've ever owned oh! oh pivot track ow darn hillbillies well we're all picked up how's a lot of decoys boys they went up easy and went down easy you know what I mean that was a hundred that was roughly a hundred and ten ish hundred and fifteen dozen decoys total silos and socks all that's all that's into what the entire spread was but uh nine guys nine man limit of specs we were done and literally the hunt only lasted about 45 minutes that was about it but what hell back at the house here and i'll tell you what i was uh i spent more time driving to and from the field than i did actually hunting it was a 45 minute drive one way so if you add that up it's about the same amount of time setting up decoys hunting and tearing down as it was me behind the steering wheel that's what you call a good hunt right there boys but remember guys the duck hunter die t-shirt is available for 48 hours only two days from this video the time this video goes up two days two days is all and then she'll be gone off the site so go down below I'll put it at the top of the comment section and I'll put it down in the description it'll say duck hunter die t-shirt go down click on it and grab it it's sweet but I want to give a huge shout out to everybody that helped with the spread today especially Gerald he absolutely killed it on this field he's so good at trafficking Birds, snows, specks, candidates. He's a trafficking fool. It's what he does a ton. And he's good at it. I love hunting with the guy. 
But I want to thank you guys most of all for being here, for supporting the channel. Without you guys, the channel wouldn't be here. We wouldn't be growing such an awesome waterfowl community here. I mean, it's crazy. It's absolutely just got so much bigger than I ever guessed it would. You guys' uh, feedback has just blown me away day after day and week after week. Now that the season's here, it's bigger and better than ever. And uh, I cannot thank you guys enough. Each item that you purchase from Ducks goes directly to supporting me. So, without you guys, I couldn't keep coming back and bringing these videos to you and all this saucy duck hunting content without your help. Thank you so much. But like this video if you did, and if you have any suggestions for other videos or other sort of kinds of different, different hunting that you guys want me to do, drop it down below and let me know. But subscribe if you haven't. We will see you guys on the next one. Have a good one, y'all. Peace.